Hey guys, what's up? I know it's been a while since I've shot a video, um, but I'm here today to unbox um, a new case um, that uh, they yeah, and they make some wicked cases. Um, they make them um, for the iPhone 4, which is you know what's in here, um, the iPad 2 and 3. Um, I think Amazon Kindle Fire, and that's it right now. But they did tell me that they are gonna that they're planning on releasing some new products. Um, I don't know if they'll be based around this kind of design or if they'll be new ones. Or new, maybe they're just new phone for new phones, or you know, I don't really know. But um, I've already used this and opened it, but I would just want to show you um, how it all comes. So you'll get in the box here, obviously. Um, but first, I'm going to talk to you about um, how much this is going to, this kind of case is going to run. Um, this case runs about uh, from the cheapest to forty dollars um, to the, I think, I guess the highest price it could be is about fifty um, if you add another step you can customize this and that adds seven eight dollars to the cost um but they also have some deluxe like two or three deluxe like interiors of this case and um i don't know if they are extra or not um you'll have to just check the website i'll leave a link in the video description but um we have paperwork uh this is just a slip that uh, the packing slip that's what it is so they sent me let me actually look at this here so it um, has a deep sky blue interior with a custom monogram and they did put my name Emily on there so yeah pretty cool so we'll have to look at that so you take it out and there it is so um, that's all you get in the box move that to the side and there is no like retail packaging um, quite yet so it'll you know just come with this little clear piece of plastic we'll get that out of the way as well and you get this little card there I kind of like a business card it just says handmade iPad and iPhone cases exhibit.com they're based out of Santa Cruz um, and San Francisco and then they um, again it says that these are handcrafted by local artisans they are book bound solid bamboo cases so they are really cool so um, let's just get into it here's what it looks like so the way this works um, I'll move the strap out of the way so you can see my monogram there it looks really nice silver um, it can be up to seven characters by the way and it again adds eight dollars to the cost um, the outside is a black leather and that is the only color you can get right now is just black leather um, with the you know the black strap so it's just an elastic excuse me strap right sewn in the back of the case so it feels pretty durable that won't pop out or anything um, you can see we got a camera cut on the back they have a logo which I don't like it's obnoxious like it's just really big and I don't I, some people won't care some people don't like it I usually don't care but this is just huge so it's kind of turn it's kind of a turn off there but whatever you can see there's a bamboo and they actually made the grain to uh, go and it's supposed to mimic a book they made the grain um, to look like a book so that's really cool and uh, so you open it up and this is where it gets cool this is my interior it's a deep sky blue like it said it is almost like a canvas material it's not like a microfiber but it won't you know scratch your screen or anything but it's really durable like this whole case is so durable you have leather you have um, industrial grade uh, rubber or uh, surgical grade rubble rubber excuse me in the corners all four corners there the bamboo solid bamboo and the really um, strong durable interior now I think they left this open to um, so you can get heat so the heat can escape through the case because it would be kind of hard to uh, get heat through the bamboo. But to install it, you just take your iPhone. Um, I go button side first. Now I think these rubber pieces here, um, here you just push the other side in. And you want to just go around and make sure it's completely seated in the case because there's no clicking or anything to know that it's in. But once it's in, it won't you know be falling out or anything like that. Um, the rubber I think keeps the phone in there You know, is what I think it's there for. Um, but you know once you close it all up and everything you have a really nice elegant looking case meant to look like a journal or a book so you can see here's my name again you have the elastic strap um, so we open it up and um, I mean again this won't scratch your screen or anything so you got the uh, front here go to the very bottom and you have you know your cutouts for your 30 pin dock your speaker mic no issues with uh, you know using the mic or anything it's not blocked at all you cannot dock with this case, but I had no issues with any um, cables. 
Volume buttons are easy to get to. Now the vibrate switch is kind of hard because you have this little area right here where it's in the way. But it will work with the Verizon, you know, iPhone 4S, you know, all that. Up top again, power button's pretty easy to get to. Same with headphone jack and secondary mic. No issues with any headphones, you know, that are, you know, that go this way, the angled ones. But the straight ones, you know, again, there's that little area where it's kind of in the way. You just have to really kind of work it in there, and it worked fine. No lay on the table design, but you really don't need it because you'd always have this closed. Um, now, what I like to, what I would have liked to see is they remove this whole strap and make these magnets. You know, put the magnets here, so it just looks a lot cleaner without the strap. Because you know, if you're texting someone, you don't want to be putting this around, opening it up, do 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 whatever. Keep doing that. It's just kind of annoying. Um, but this is a seriously solid case. Um, I would not want to drop it because it's just so beautiful. Um, but you would be protected. And uh, I forgot to mention that you do have your camera and, uh, flash, no issues. The strap will be out of the way, obviously, because you have to open the case to use the camera. Um, but, I mean, it, it just looks really cool. Now, one thing I didn't like. Obviously, this is going to add bulk and weight. This is not meant to look thin or sleek or, you know, slim. This is a conversation piece, I think. Um, even people are going to say, wow, is that an iPhone case or a book, you know? They really, people are going to think you're carrying around a book, but then you, you know, open it up and you're messing with your phone. So it kind of throw people off. Um, but it's just really bulky. It won't fit in pockets or anything. Um, you know, a purse would be fine, a bag, a book bag would be fine. But I just wish, um, you know, I, I mean, it's not going to be for everyone is what I'm trying to get here. Some people won't want to carry this around. You know, I do sometimes, you know, but this is not going to be an everyday case for me. Um, it's just, you know, a lot of work to open it up. And, you know, to have to carry it around. I mean, again, you can't put it in your pocket, so you have one hand always with your phone. So I was in the grocery store just trying to get some stuff. And I only had one hand because I'm holding my phone in this book. Um, so it was kind of a, you know, a drawback there. But if you really want a conversation piece, you know, a case that probably no one has. Because if you get your name on it, no one really has that case. And people are just going to really be like, wow, what is that? Where can I get it? How can I get it? So I want to thank Exhibit for saying this one out for me to review. I really do appreciate it. They did a magnificent job. And I'm really thrilled to be working with them in the future and see all their other products. Um, so again, description. Um, I'll leave a link to their website. And um, I hope you guys have a great day. See ya.